Racing and breeding pigeons is a rewarding pursuit, but like any living athlete, your birds are susceptible to health issues. One of the more concerning viral threats in pigeon lofts is adenovirus infection. While it's not as well known as some other pigeon diseases, its impact can be devastating, especially when left unchecked or combined with secondary infections like E. coli. What is adenovirus in pigeons? Adenovirus in pigeons is a viral infection that primarily affects their gastrointestinal system. There are two types of adenovirus that impact pigeons. Type 1. This form mainly affects young pigeons and is often associated with stress or poor hygiene. Symptoms include diarrhea, weight loss, and other signs of gastrointestinal distress. While contagious, it is usually not fatal, and pigeons tend to recover within 5 to 10 days. Type 2. Known as necrotizing hepatitis, this type is more severe and can affect adult pigeons. It leads to liver damage and can be fatal if not treated promptly. Symptoms include vomiting, fatigue, anorexia, and green watery diarrhea. The disease often spreads through contaminated droppings, feed, or water, and can be exacerbated by bacterial infections like E. coli. Proper hygiene and stress management are crucial in preventing outbreaks. Currently, there is no commercial vaccine specifically for pigeon adenovirus. However, research is ongoing, and some lofts that experience repeated outbreaks may work with avian vets to develop customized immunity plans. Until then, strong biosecurity and supportive care remain your best line of defense. Preventing adenovirus in your loft. Prevention is the best cure when it comes to viral infections. You can dramatically reduce your risk of an outbreak with these proactive steps. Quarantine any new birds for two to four weeks. Observe for signs of illness before integrating into the loft. Sanitize feeders regularly. Ensure good ventilation to avoid damp, stale air. Treatment options. What can you do? Since adenovirus is a virus, antibiotics won't work directly. However, supportive care and treatment for secondary bacterial infections are critical for recovery. Sick pigeons lose fluids quickly. Offer clean, fresh water at all times. Add electrolyte solutions to maintain hydration and help restore mineral balance. Give easily digestible, high-quality feed. Adding vitamins, especially A and C, helps boost the immune system. Use supplements to maintain energy levels and support recovery. Adenovirus often leads to secondary E. coli infections, which can be fatal without intervention. Treat with a broad-spectrum antibiotic like amoxicillin, usually 3 grams per gallon of water for 7 days. Lastly, give probiotics after the treatment. 